Hey guys, how's it going? Lee John Blackmore here at Super Easy Guitar. Thanks for joining me again for another super easy tutorial. Uh, this week we're doing Wish You Were Here by Pink Floyd. Let's get straight into it. So again, there's a few uh, videos on YouTube here, so I thought I'd break it down a little bit easier, uh, a little bit different so it's easier to understand, okay? Um, I'm actually going to uh, zoom the camera in a little bit closer for this one for a change, okay? Okay, this is based around three chords. It's based around this G, and then an A7, sus4, and then another version of A7, sus4. So the difference is, the one without my finger, you hear the G ring out, okay? And when we put the second finger down, you hear that note becomes A. So you hear the A note ring out very subtle difference. Okay, so let's go into the main riff. So, it goes, so third, then play open A, then hammer on the second fret on the A string, okay? Then open D. Then first finger is going to play this a7 sus4 with the second finger away. And we're just going to pluck that D string on the second fret. Then strum. So very slowly. Now, if you can't do a hammer on, okay, so it's basically pluck hammering the finger down so we don't have to pluck it again, but if you can't get the pluck-ons yet, if you're a super beginner, just pluck it, okay? So that'll be G, which is 3, O, 2, O on the D, 2 on the D, there's your first position. Then it goes, pluck that D again, the second fret, then open G, D, then open D. Finish off with the G. So we've got. again. So now on the third time we do it, it changes on the way back. Here we go, now it's the change. Okay, so what we're doing, so we've strummed that A7 sus, okay, then we're plucking the second fret on the D string, open, second fret on the A string, open, then we're doing the second A sus chord, where our second finger goes down. So from the top. change. That stays the same, but now then we do a little just a hammer on without the third. Okay? So if we go from the top
changes. Here we go. Without the third. So it's that second phrase repeated again. From the top one more time. change. Here we go. Next chord. Without the third fret. That just repeats. Then finally, so that last piece is just O, hammer, Open D, G. So that last bit again. Open A, hammer on the second fret, play an open D string, and then finish with a G. Then we're into the verse. C, D, minor G D This time to C A minor and back to G Okay so let's have a look at the rhythm uh, for a beginner, I would highly recommend just doing straight. Okay, and get used to the chords. It's going to sound fine, alright? But if you want something a little bit more complicated, it's not exactly what they do, but it'll put you in the right, uh, it'll put you in the right direction. Okay, so that'll just get you going. All right, if you're if you're not used to these down and up strokes, then just do it really slow. Okay. So there you have it, guys. Wish you were here by Pink Floyd. I hope you've enjoyed this week's tutorial. I do these every week, so don't forget to subscribe to my channel. You can find me on Instagram, you can find me on Facebook. Please send me any requests if you have any requests. There's other videos on my channel, check them out. If you're learning guitar, send me any requests. If you have any requests, I'll do my best to get them. Please give me a thumbs up, I really appreciate it, and I'll see you the same time next week. Bye.